all right hello hello everyone it's natalie here back with another message for you guys i hope everyone is doing well we're gonna tap in see what spirit needs us to know keep in mind energies can be reversed time is fluid all right if anyone needs a confirmation you're more than, more than welcome to reach out to me for a personal all right if this reading does not resonate with you okay um please do not take every part of the reading as something that's going on in your life it may not resonate for you okay let's see what is the energy please for the collective right now all right so we got the two of pentacles out here with the eight of swords reverse page of wands with the seven of wands reverse three of wands it looks like someone here is like trying to gain balance or they're trying to stay afloat with something because someone else is being empowered they're being free they're being released from something okay someone is no longer insecure so it's causing someone to be unbalanced they're trying to juggle life and their priorities let's see what else also, if you're trying to juggle your priorities, you're doing just fine with that. As long as you're free, you're good, okay? So we have the King of Wands reversed with the Two of Swords reversed here. So it looks like someone here is nasty, impulsive, abusive, and temperamental. Someone has anger problems. Someone feels like they got to do something now. They got to do something about your freedom, I guess. Um... Yeah, they're having a lot of inner turmoil here indecision so someone here does not know what to do about your freedom i guess this is also someone who feels like they can control people with physical action like putting their hands on them i guess uh this could be a man doesn't have to be a man it could be a someone who's very aggressive when they see people free they feel like they can the only way they can control that person's freedom is by putting their hands on them, I guess. Someone is very impulsive, like they act out of anger, very abusive. Someone's really angry right now, okay? Then we have the Seven of Pentacles in reverse. Laziness, disappointment, impatient, lack of growth. Yeah, see, this person is like, when things don't go their way, it's like, I have to beat them in some weird way. But you're fearless. Someone feels like they can't put any fear in you anymore. It's like you're, you're not afraid of this person, it looks like. And you know how to make your own decisions here. Nine of Pentacles reverse. Lack of funds, failure, deceit, bad investment. Five of Swords is here. Looks like someone is trying to find someone to blame. They can't blame you for being free. You're just being free. You're just being in your own element here. Or you're being what you should have been a long time ago. This is also giving me energy of like... You guys have found your north node and you're empowered. They could be blaming someone else, someone who was a bad investment. Maybe they invested poorly into somebody. Yeah, the star in reverse, faithlessness, discouragement, insecurity, and despair. Justice reverse, dishonesty, unaccountability, unfairness, and legal flaws. I don't know why earlier I was getting like downloads of how like they controlled slaves they basically controlled slaves by telling them they're nothing okay i feel like this is the type of mind control that they thought that they could put onto you um yeah this person doesn't take accountability for things that go on in their life so they try to put their insecurities onto other people someone is also a dream killer someone is very is a very unfair person here yeah disaster or dictator i want to say disaster though dictator oppressive brutal, brutal and controlling because of the page of pentacles it's like every time someone learns something they try to tell someone no you didn't learn that right or um they try to put roadblocks for somebody they try to create adversity or unfair situations for somebody or they feel like something should be unfair for you i guess anything else what's the message but i feel like this is how this person feels about themselves they feel this about themselves and they have like no accountability yeah the queen of swords is here this is who they're trying to control someone who's honest protective witty and intelligent this is also someone that can't even take a joke this is a man that can't even take a joke okay 
Like it's, it's like they see, it's like if you're having too much fun doing something, you're not in your North Node. This is also someone who doesn't believe in someone loving their work. It's like you don't, you're not supposed to love your work. You're supposed to hate your work or you're supposed to be depressed at work or something. So that's not work if you love it or that's not work if you're having fun with it. Like this person's really, they're, they're really controlling. Yeah, heartbreaker, moodiness, unrequited love, troublemaker. Someone is just mad that like you, something is too peaceful for you. You have some sort of sense of humor here and someone's trying to control that. You do something with a sense of humor or you do something smart or you may do something the easy way. Not like the lazy way though because I feel like this person is also trying to like put the stigma on you that like you're lazy or something because um, the way that you see work is not work for you. Okay, you're just very fearless and enthusiastic. Okay, you could be at like a job where everything's supposed to be taken seriously. Okay, I'm picturing like a office job, but you walk in and your suit has like polka dots on it or something and someone's like, oh, you got a sense of humor, huh? I, I don't know. It's like they don't want you to have a sense of humor with whatever you're doing here. It makes them mad. Okay, what's Eight of Swords reverse? Eight of Wands reverse. Slow movement, delayed action, waiting game, and impatient. Yeah, something's going on with this person's patience. It's like if you're not... Ooh, someone is trying to deceive you, so be careful. I feel like there's a dangerous energy here. They do this when they don't have control. Someone is trying to have control over a woman. A man's trying to have certain control over a woman here. What's the Eight of Wands reverse? Something is going back on somebody. Someone feels like you're not being taken out fast enough. Yeah, magician. Willpower, desire, creation, manifestation. Something about your energy. It's like you never run out of energy or willpower. It's making this person like... They're getting tired or they're getting sick trying to attack you. Yeah, they have a lack of courage trying to block you or something. It's like you have conquered your abuser or you conquered some sort of like construct or I was also watching this documentary about school and I don't want to get too much into it because it's going to bring attention from, you know, people that are in the higher up. So I don't want to get their attention. But basically, like, school is meant to create workers, not businessmen, not businesswomen. Um, the education system is there to create workers, and that's it. Um, Something like that here. And I feel like you like beat a construct or you like beat an idea. What's the king of wands in the reverse? It's like something about having your own mind is a threat. That's why I was getting that slavery stuff. It's like if you knew how to read, you'd, be, you'd get punished. Or if you thought with some sense, you'd be punished. If you made sense, you should be punished because you make sense. Like, that's how this energy is looking at you. What's the King of Wands reverse? Knight of Wands. Yeah, confident, adventurous, energetic, and charming. You could be younger than these people or this person. It's like it's making this person mad, but they cannot stop you. What's the Knight of Wands reverse? They just don't like your confidence. Knight of Pentacles, protective, conservative, patient, and tentative. Financial collapse, make money, or fake money, family feud, loss, lack of center, lost inner voice, repressed feelings, secrets. This must be like government stuff is what I'm getting here. The government doesn't want to create influencers. They don't want to create people that can be creative and energetic and charming and it's like... I don't know why, but it's their own fault. Why would they create the internet and then get mad when people are using the internet for their own benefit? I don't understand this. Same thing with slaves. Why are you teaching slaves? Why are you shoving the Bible down slaves' throats and then getting mad when they can read it? 
and read it with their own interpretations. Why are you getting mad about it? It's something like that. It's like something about like abusers or controllers. They made these, they made stuff like this. Why would you make it hard to work a 40 hour day job and then get mad when they find their way out of a 40 hour job? Why don't you just make the jobs easier and less abusive? That way they would want to stay. It's something like that. It's like, People have beaten society down to only make them better and even better than the people trying to control them. It's that type of energy. For others of you, it may just be like people around you. It's just like, I don't know. It's like their own idea of like what growth is or success is. It's totally different from what his, what it is like 30 years ago. People have their own idea of what success is now. And it's like everything is collapsing now. It might actually cause a financial collapse because of this. Because it's like... <laughs> it's like something isn't... It, it, people aren't feeding into what things used to be anymore. They're not feeding into the whole 9 to 5 anymore. And the people, the higher ups don't like it. I don't know. What's the Two of Swords reverse? What's the Two of Swords reverse? It says indecision, overthinking, seeing the truth, and inner turmoil. It's like people are, they have to deal with this energy. They have to deal with it because they created it. What's the Two of Swords reverse? The Lover's reverse. This will also be an X here. Loss of balance, one-sidedness, disharmony, and infidelity. Ten of Swords. Yeah, this could be an X here too. They feel betrayed or they feel like they're at rock bottom because they thought that they can control like your mindset or something. Yeah, they were being deceiving the whole time here. Also, something about like raising your children. There's like a bunch of messages that I'm getting here. Someone feels betrayed because of some or about you breaking up with somebody or you just see something differently than someone else. What's the Nine of Pentacles reverse? Knight of Pentacles and the Queen of Pentacles. Also, you're being compared to somebody here. Emperors here. Fatherhood, authority, structure, and control. You walked away from like a structure. From you walking away from a community or like a family or something like that, people respect you for it. Okay, but they don't like it because it's like they something is falling down for them or nobody respects them anymore. It's kind of like, you know, the government. It could be that deep, but this could be like someone that you were with. Someone is practical, business-oriented, grounded, and generous. You're being compared uh, to somebody who was a bad investment, too. Like, maybe your ex left you for someone that was a bad investment. And you do things, like, maturely or you're very responsible. Conservative. Isn't that, like, Republicans or something? I don't know. But I'm definitely getting something about politics and government issues, too, with this. What's the star reverse? The seven of cups. Opportunities, fantasy, illusions, and decisions here. And the nine of wands. Yeah, it's like... Someone feels exposed or like they have to defend their energy because there's something here about you having a lot of options or it's too hard for someone to keep keep something up because you're okay, you're comfortable. It's like you're you're beating some sort of energy of like control. Someone may be competing with you or going against you. Okay. You could be like at home working and someone else has a nine to five. They're trying their best to make it look like you doing what you're doing is very irresponsible. 
but they're trying hard to make you look irresponsible is what I'm getting here. They're trying a little bit too hard though. And like they're worn out and they're the ones that are looking irresponsible. What's the nine of wands, seven of cups? It's like they're confused. It's like they're trying to set up illusions, but it's really hard to set up illusions. Yeah, lack of focus, boring job, overworked perfectionist. This person has a boring job, this queen of wands reverse. She's self-conscious, she's catty. She's like, she's very judgmental. She's competing with you. She can't even focus on her job that she says is so much better than yours. That's what I'm saying here. It's like, it could be like multiple people in this energy. It might not just be one person. Yeah, loneliness, isolation. She lost her way. She's a misfit. Meanwhile, you're the page of cups. Happy news, crush, spirituality, and creativity. Someone is a dictator, oppressive. An oppressor is trying to make you look irresponsible. Yeah, it's, could be, it could be women out here. And I feel like there's a man out here too, and he's like, he went and get, he was going against you at first, but now he's like, but they're more responsible than you. You work a nine to five and you're a prostitute. So <laughs> it's like something out here is going on like that. And they have a boring job or they're overworked and they're not getting anything done. Or it's like, I don't know why I'm not, I'm not, there's nothing wrong with having a nine to five. We've all done it, but it's something about like trying to make you look irresponsible that these people are failing at. What's justice in the reverse? Two of wands reverse, stuck at home, indecision, delayed plans, fear of change. This is two of wands reverse. The chariot in reverse. Lack of control, lost aggression, and self doubt. Someone could be having car trouble, car troubles, which is why they're stuck at home. This is also an energy that I picked up last week, where I'm getting like someone wants to do what you do, whether you're an influencer or maybe you sell things from home. Maybe you have your own business. Maybe you have your own online things that you sell. It might not even be like an influencer. Maybe you just sell things, and someone doesn't even know where to start. They feel like it's not fair, but they don't take any accountability. They don't push themselves. This is someone here that does not want to be seen in the spotlight. They don't want to put themselves out there like that. And they're getting angry with themselves and the people around them. And they're not taking any accountability for it. Yeah, four of cups. It's like everything is everybody else's fault. Skeptical, apathy, negative outlook, contemplation. And meanwhile, you're in the six of wands and you walked away from this energy I, I, I'm hearing you saying, I remember I used to be like that. So maybe there was a time where you were very skeptical and you blamed everyone in your life for the reason why you couldn't make things happen and then you snapped out of it. It's like, we all gotta start somewhere. I'm not saying if you have a nine to five, you're not chosen and you're not doing the right thing in life. That's not what I'm saying. I'm saying that we all had to start there. We all had to start at a regular job and then we started coming up with ideas. But this person has no ideas or they're blaming everyone around them or it's like they lost control of their life and they don't even believe in themselves. What's the Knight of Cups reverse? Someone is very fake in your energy. What's the Knight of Cups reverse? Someone is also very jealous and moody around you or something. What's the Knight of Cups reverse? Or they act like they um, support you or they're very kind, but they're not. What's the Knight of Cups reverse? Yeah, the moon. They're very deceptive. They got secrets. They have a, a, a different motive here. What's the moon with the Knight of Cups reverse? Yeah, uh, Wheel of Fortune reverse. No control, breaking cycles, bad luck, and disappointment. This person is blaming a lot of people for the reason why they have, like, bad luck here. This person cannot balance their life at all. And you know what? It's, it's not their fault. I mean, we do live in an economy where it's hard for us to, you know, buy a house. And it's not all their fault, but they have to dig themselves out of this. Like, you can do it. Whoever's watching me and they're in this energy... You can do it. Like, why are you so 
I don't know, this person has a negative outlook. They're saying, no, I can't do it. So you can't do it either. No, like this person, this, this person who's doing it is actually, nothing can stop them because of their mindset. It's all in the mind. Manifestation starts in your mind and in your heart. You have to love what you do. You can't just, that's another thing too. It's like manifestation starts in your heart, really. First, you got to think up the idea in your head. Then you have to, your heart has to follow it. This person has like no heart or something for anything. What's the Wheel of Fortune reverse with the moon? Yeah, five of wands. Arguments, aggression, chaos, and competition. This person sees you as competition, but there is no competition. You don't you have no heart. Yeah, the Queen of Wands reverse, no heart. Knight of Swords here with the Temperance here. Assertive, direct action, impatient, heroic. Also, there's a female here that's that is in competition with you, and she wants to take your energy so that a uh, a man will like her more or something. What's the Queen of Wands reverse? And that's another thing too. I think I just I got this download earlier today too. It's like a lot of women want to become bosses and CEOs and stuff like that, not for themselves but for attention from men. Sacrifice, release, pause, new perspective. Yeah, this Empress in Reverse with the Five of Cups. If someone is aware or they see this Empress in Reverse as like, like your copycat or someone that wants to be you, but they got the wrong idea about it. You don't, you don't do stuff like this just to get attention from men, okay? That's what this woman does. She does things to try to get attention from men. And that's another reason why you're not, this person will never succeed because they're not doing it for themselves. They don't want to do it for themselves. You could be a woman who, who's running a business, a CEO of a business and everything and have everything together and very accomplished and successful. And that man is still going to leave you for someone else that has less. It's like it has nothing to do with what you have. And I keep getting this energy of like, Someone is trying to project the energy of laziness on you because you have fun doing what you're doing. That doesn't make any sense. It's like you're supposed to be sweating at work and carrying big boxes and you're not supposed to be living the soft life at all. It's like some, I don't know, some women just naturally gravitate the soft life to them. And there's nothing wrong with that. This woman here has to grab, they, they're working and they have to do that. It's like there's nothing wrong with that either, but... I feel like someone is trying to like keep you, they're trying to abuse you because you are what? Enthusiastic and have new ideas. We have the nine of swords here. It's like people are stressed out about your energy or someone is stressed out. Someone is up all night. You have the hierophant because of the respect that you get. There's something here about your spiritual respect or your rank and the respect that you have. Like you're a counselor or you're a teacher or something. And they just can't take it. They can't understand it. I will never hate on somebody like this. I will become that or go find something else to do. Like that's what I'm saying. Like I encourage everyone, if you're jealous about what I'm doing, make a channel about it. I don't know. Make your own channel. Try to do it too. Anybody, I always tell people you could do it too. I never tell, I never gatekeep or try to block people from doing what I'm doing. I encourage people to do what I'm doing if they really want to and if they really have the heart to do it. That's how I feel like you guys are like, if you guys sell candles, you're trying to teach people how to do it and they don't wanna do it. They just don't want you doing it so they're gonna try to block you from doing it. Yeah, we have the 10 of coins here, you have a legacy or your ancestors are, are protecting this. Five of coins in the reverse. Your money could be improving also or it will be improving. Someone may want a commitment with you. Ten of coins with the Hierophant here. Two of swords is here with the eight of swords. King of coins. Page of coins reverse. The Wheel of fortune. I feel like a lot of good things are going to be coming into your life, but people just refuse to see it or... I don't know. Everybody has haters, though. It could be Aquarius, Taurus energy. Libra. You guys could be these signs or someone else's. What's the energy? 
Yeah, the Empress in Reverse. What is this female so stressed out about? I just don't get it. She's very insecure, very trapped. And I'm not even, like, trying to put her down. I'm just saying, like... If you feel like you deserve this life, this lifestyle, or if you deserve to be like an empress, you know, sitting pretty or whatever, you need to work for that first. You have to put yourself in position for that. It's like someone wants your position in something, but they're not even ranked enough to take your spot. Seven of Wands. I'm hearing you guys had to go through a lot. You guys had to defend yourself. If they really want to do something like this, they're going to have to constantly deal with people trying to attack them. They're going to have to go through a lot here. If they really want that type of life, if they really want your life, if they really want your sh want, want to walk in your shoes, they're going to have to deal with constant persecution because of what you do. You do something very different than everybody else. So, of course, you're going to get persecuted. And then you got people that want to do what you do, but they have no idea what it takes. Persecution, focus, uh, being talked bad about. You know how many bad comments I get in my comment section? I just heart it. I don't care. They have to deal with stuff like that. They don't want the bad parts about your destiny. They want only the good parts. They would not be able to deal with it. Four of Wands. I really feel like you guys are going to be like moving soon or coming into a relationship and coming together with somebody. Maybe that's another thing that this uh, Empress is worried about. She's trying to distract someone from investing in you. Give me another one. Yeah, Six of Wands. You guys are going to be very successful or gain a lot of attention here. Someone is just like in denial. They refuse to see this. They want to be stuck, so let them be stuck. Knight of Swords Reverse, Knight of Coins. Someone is mad at you or, or they want you to be seen as irresponsible. They do not want you to be seen as responsible at all. It's like I'm getting these people or this woman here because she came out. She's here twice. This Empress in Reverse here. She just wants you to be seen as irresponsible and that's not your energy at all. I feel like she's the one that's irresponsible. What's the uh, five of coins reverse? The sun. Yeah, I feel like something something good is going to be happening with your guys' money. Something that you manifest. Maybe you guys did a spell recently for money. Only your money, like no one else's money, okay? When you guys do spells, you guys never... Um, you don't wish bad on others while you're doing the spell. You only wish good for yourself or you wish good for others. That's going to help you manifest more abundance and happiness for you. Five of Pentacles in reverse with the sun. See, that another thing too, if, like, if you're like a white witch or something. Yeah, what the heck? Mm. But I feel like it's still going, it's still going to... You know what I'm getting here? It's like... Okay. Like I said in the beginning, if, if there's something here about like, okay, you can do it too. But this person just does not want you to succeed because it's going to make them look like they can't take care of themselves. But they don't want to do it. They don't want to actually do the hard work or something. Someone is, is exposed by your abundance of what you got going on here. You're not out in the cold, so it, it, it automatically exposes them as, like, what, a prostitute? Or Nine of Coins is, like, either a prostitute or they cannot take care of themselves. They don't know themselves. They cannot do anything alone. Nine of Coins upright is independence. Nine of Coins in reverse is the opposite of independence and abundance and stuff like that. They have, like, nothing to eat is what I'm hearing. I don't know. I wouldn't wish stuff like this on my worst enemy, but they're wishing stuff like this on you. What's the Empress in the reverse? Wheel of Fortune in reverse. Things, yeah, this person is getting a lot of karma here. Things are not turning the right way. And then look, the Knight of Pentacles, responsibilities. You're taking care of your, responsi your responsibilities and they're in victim mode because, yeah, they feel like something is not fair. I don't understand this person. Like... What's the Wheel of Fortune reverse with the Empress reverse? Like you gotta work. 
you gotta work or you gotta like do something here someone is seeing someone is saying that they're more responsible than you because they have a job okay and you are self-employed okay self-employed nobody employed you is what i'm getting for that meaning you pay taxes okay ace of cups is here it wanted to fall on the floor but i'm gonna put that back what's the wheel of fortune nervers like i don't i can do what they do i can go hot get hired at a job any day but they can't do what i do they can't be self-employed and be successful with it and not fall off you see what i mean but you're irresponsible okay yeah eight of swords someone is stuck i mean yeah three of wands reverse page of coins reverse five of wands reverse four of swords reverse the lovers reverse someone is being broken up with or i'm also getting like there's a mask on here that like maybe have left you for somebody here this is like an ex or something. You don't want anything to do with them. And they're with someone that claims they're more responsible than you. But the proof is in the pudding. They're not. What's the seven of wands? The moon. What's the moon with the seven of wands? I feel like someone's being deceptive trying to block you. The Knight of Swords reverse. Yeah, projection. So someone's doing a lot of projection lately. Over the weekend, maybe, since I stopped um, posting. Four of Coins with the Queen of Wands. Two of Wands reverse and the King of Coins. I feel like deep down inside, like someone really worships you, but they act like they don't. They're like, why are they, why are they not receiving any disasters? Why aren't they having disasters? What's the four of wands? The chariot reverse. What's the chariot reverse with the four of wands? Someone's home life might not be okay. The High Priestess. There's also something that you know or that you're keeping a secret here. You know that someone's trying to block you. So I feel like you're just moving accordingly here. Yeah, the Three of Swords. This could also be like Mistress type of energy. Someone's upset about what you're doing in your home. Like, very weird. Yeah, four of cups. They, they feel rejected. Three of coins reversed in the death card. This is someone that's attached to your ex is what I'm getting here. They're upset about what you're doing in your home or that your home is stable or something. It's a mistress type of energy with the uh, high priestess and the three of swords. This person has been quiet in, in the background, behind the scenes. Hurt and betrayed about your stability or angry or... Like their life is not okay because your home is stable. What's the six of wands? I feel like you're not paying any attention to this person. Or you're not paying attention to who they're paying attention to, so you don't care. Yeah, the hermit reverse. You guys could be getting outside more. Or you're coming out more. Ace of coins reverse. Someone sees you as a missed opportunity. Yeah, three of cups reverse with the star. And I feel like whoever your ex is with, everyone that your ex is with, they just wish that they can be you. I don't know why I'm getting this. It's like someone sees you as like a missed opportunity or like your ex sees you as a missed opportunity. So it's like these females are worried or they're angry. Everyone wishes they could be you. They all want to be the star. It's like they all wish on the star that one day they could be you, but no one's putting in any work. That's what I'm saying. Like, I have nothing wrong with my enemies trying to be me. If you could do me better than me, then I encourage you to do it. All right. But if you can't, don't get mad at everybody around you because 
like you have to take accountability you have to take accountability i'm getting like you guys even try to teach these people to do something like if you do tarot maybe you try to teach if you actually try to teach your enemies to do tarot and they still don't want to do it yeah stop break stop pause stagnation someone wants to stop being your enemy someone wants to stop being a third wheel to something here yeah, because now things are getting awkward. It's like you're losing to someone that is self-employed or something. Like, type of energy. Or it's like things are just awkward for them. Like, everything is, like, going backwards for them. Okay, real estate, wealth, investment, mega project. I feel like you guys are going to be moving soon is what I'm getting for this. Or you guys are wealthy or you will be or something. Yeah, death in the reverse. Yeah, someone wanted something here to end for you. Care, readiness. Someone is ready to, like, start something with you, too. Maybe someone new here. What else? Accident, reverse, danger, caution, injury, illness. Someone is sick because, like, you're not having any sort of injuries or you're not... Someone wanted, like, some sort of sickness spell to go on you. Now they're frightened because you're not listening to something. Yeah, I'm also getting, like, you... You were someone that's, that was supposed to be a slave. That's what I'm getting here. It's like they wanted you to be a slave. They wanted you to work constantly and not receive any abundance or to struggle or to live check to check or something out here like that. You're not in that energy. If you do, if you ever end up in that energy, you easily come up out of it or God always works in your favor. Someone is weak because of this. Someone couldn't cause accidents for you or something. Yeah, trap in the reverse. Like I said, you're not a slave. Confinement is here. Someone else is not free. Someone else is not free. So they want to like run your name through the dirt or cause a protesting energy, like protest against you. Like I said, this is something like, this is something about nine to fives versus self-employed. It's like, they just, ugh, they just can't stand it. They, they need you out of the way or they need you to stop doing that or whatever. And it's not working. <laughs> Readiness in the reverse. Or they like try to run your name through the streets and you're self-employed as if, I don't know, like, whatever you do by yourself, you don't really have a boss, so who the heck is going to fire you? Only you can fire you. They want you to get sick. The only way that things th things could turn around for you is if you get sick or something. And I feel like they're the ones getting sick. Someone wasn't ready. They're, they weren't prepared for something to not end for you. Okay? origin is here that's another thing too it's like you have to be if you're really going to throw out energy like this yeah homeless is in the reverse with coach in the reverse with fright here if you really wanted something bad to happen to somebody you need to be prepared for when things backfire onto you i'm hearing you never run out of creativity or you never run out of like uh ideas stubbornness with right here Someone is very arrogant. They were trying to involve you in some sort of spell here. Or like uh, moon magic or whatever. Like fear or something like that. But you're too calm for that. I'm telling you, this is giving like slave master. Trying to control his slaves or keep them in order. Or keep them working or keep them working hard. Or not in the energy of uh, having fun whatever that they do. It's very weird. So, like, maybe this happened in a past life to you guys. Or maybe this happened to an ancestor of yours. What was that? Oh. Maybe this happened to, like, an ancestor of yours. Where, like, something here was, like, it's, it's out of the norm or it's controversial or something. And they just thought that they can, like, break you down or... It was their job to take you out of the game or get you to stop. 
Gentleness is the path of peace. The Lord is my shepherd. I have all that I need. Psalm 31, 1 through 3. Or I'm sorry, Psalm 23, 1 through 3. I'm all over the place. Yeah, then we have a happy home. My people will live in safety quietly at home. They will be at rest. This is your guys' energy. These people try to ruin your home life or something. I feel like it's backfiring onto them. It says my people will live in safety quietly at home. They will be at rest. Isaiah 32, 18. His people, not the, the other people. Everybody else probably don't live uh, quietly at home, safety and at peace and at rest. You know, but his people do. So it is what it is. Something about like being actually working for God and actually doing what he told you to do. You're going to be at peace. You're going to be at rest. Okay. If you work for the man, if you work for the devil, or you if you work for society or I'm getting also that uh, Bible scripture. I don't know where it is, but it's talking about um, people who love the world are the enemy of God. Like people that love the world and they do everything that the world does and uh, they go by society views are are their enemies to God. So that's why these people are getting sick. God does not support whatever these people are trying to do to you, you know? And I know what you guys are going to say. Well, God doesn't support tarot. God doesn't support tarot. Well, isn't he the judge of that? You're not the judge of that. God also hates when people try to do his job for him. He's the judge. So you're going to get knocked on your butt for condemning people. It doesn't say nowhere in the Bible that we're supposed to work nine to fives, pay bills, and just die, and that's it. It doesn't say nowhere in the Bible about that. The only people that made that rule are the rich and powerful that just want to be worshipped. While they have all the money and we don't, okay? John D. Rockefeller and all those other powerful, rich people that, I don't know. All right, I'm gonna do another, I'm gonna do another reading, guys. Hope this one resonated for you. If it did, go ahead and like subscribe, share to my channel so don't miss any of my videos. I'll see you next time. Thank you. Bye.